All right, welcome everyone. We're gonna be uh, going on a little hike, a little adventure, if you will. So yeah, I know I've, I've been talking about this video for a while, and uh, I've been excited to make it. Been excited to make it. I don't know if we're gonna run up to run into people up here at this time because it is like the sun is setting. But yeah, I just wanted to show you around here because this is one of my favorite places to just walk. It's just very peaceful. So yeah, uh, there's a lot of like branching paths. Ooh, there's a pigeon. Uh, there's a lot of like branching paths and everything. So like if, if I want to go get really lost, I can. And honestly, I think that's pretty fun because that means you get to join me while I'm just lost as fuck. <laughs> So yeah, this video is probably gonna be a while, just because like, this is a very long, ooh, that's nice. Like the sun going right there. Ooh, that's, that's fucking beautiful. Look at this place, this is sick. <laughs> so yeah, I know, like we're just gonna go on a little adventure, see how it goes. So yeah. Huh. I think the forest is empty. Like, I can't hear anyone, so it's just me and you. <laughs> Still like how the sun just shines through the trees. Like, it's so nice just being in, like, these little shaded areas and seeing, like, glimpses of sunlight. I don't know why, but that's always just been something I like. There's gonna be a lot of like dead silence in this video just because, you know, it's gonna be like an hour 30 at minimum. And I don't think I can be entertaining for that long. So I'm gonna have to like space through my commentary as best as I can. I know, like I wanna at some point forget that I'm recording a video just so I can like bring you through this. Damn. This place is so sick. I love this place. You're gonna be hearing a lot of that. Oh, little bird just kind of scared me a, set, a bit. <laughs> Alright. This says to go left. I think we're gonna go straight ahead. Ooh. Or that path looks very appealing. <laughs> that little path goes out into like an opening. Here, I'll bring it through there. Why not? Why does it just say help on that? But yeah, uh, the sun is setting, so at some point tonight, well, at some point in this video, it might just get very dark. And uh, I'm pretty okay with that. So yeah, we got like this little beautiful opening. There's a path down there. But honestly, I want to go back into the shaded areas because it's very warm today <laughs> but yeah no i want to just uh be dumb in this video you know forgot everything that you know civilization has taught us i think that just also leads to the opening so go straight ahead <sighs> yeah forget like civilization exists go back to monkey Ooh, first cool stick it's like a it's like a gun. <laughs> We're gonna be doing a lot of that shit too. Just thought it is now. <laughs> Ooh, cranberries from Tesco. I'm gonna pick that up. People really gotta be better with their littering here. This place is too beautiful to just be ruined by litter. Ooh, Capri Sun. Again. There's a weird noise in that. I think it's just like dark particles. <sighs> Ooh, I like this little dark part. You know, like nettles and shit there. But yeah. I think my goal for this video, honestly, is to like inspire other people 
to go out and just document like these beautiful pieces of nature that most people probably wouldn't really see on a daily basis. Or like, you know, if you live in like a specific part of the part of the world, you know, not a lot of people are gonna know what the nature around there looks like. So yeah, this is like the big nature spot near where I live. Look at that tree, big tree. Oh, got litter. Man, people really gotta be better with this shit. <laughs> We've already picked up three things. So yeah, we got a little gun and we're picking up litter. <laughs> Whoa, that. I fucking love nature like that. It's so, it's just so sick. All the leaves. I don't know why I'm a sucker for trees. Especially tall trees. Like, yo, I feel like I'm about to like enter a magical place. <laughs> like, look at this. <laughs> no wonder the ancient Irish believed in magic. Like, you would too if you lived here. <laughs> like, this is sick. Damn. I feel like this looks like lost footage media, <laughs> especially within like the first 10 minutes. But I don't think anything bad's gonna happen to me up here. <laughs> or at least I hope. Ooh, nice little clearing. It kinda looks like a heart if you, uh, no it doesn't, but <laughs> kinda looked like it for a second. <laughs> yeah. Damn, I know why tall trees are just so sick. I wish I had like a higher quality camera because I am just recording this off my iPhone. Like I'd be able to capture more of the uh, subtler pieces of beauty if I had like that, you know, if I had a high definition camera. Oh, we got this little swing part. I remember one time me and my friends were up here and we just started playing on that for a bit. Because it's honestly pretty fun. Probably not going to play on it right now. Just because, quite honestly, I, I wouldn't know how to set up the camera to record that. But yeah. I don't even know if we're going in the right direction because there's a trail I want to follow up here. But at the same time, I want to just get lost as fuck. Ooh. I like that nice little opening. Nice little part of force. So yeah. Birds moving in the trees and shit. Oh, you can see uh you can see a horse. Here. Can you see him? There he is. There's cows further up that we'll be able to look at. So yeah. I want to get, want to surprise y'all with a shot. Boom. Look at that. That's fucking sick. Hell yeah. <laughs> Stomping around in my boots. <laughs> I have my hair tied up. Just because, quite honestly, it's too fucking hot to not have a tie up.
so yeah there were people up here <laughs> just if I end up doing that a lot in this video just know it's just because people are walking by and I don't want to record them or sound like I'm crazy talking to myself further up we get the more quiet it's gonna be like around the middle of this trail usually it's just dead quiet a lot of the people are tend tend to be focused near the beginning and the end and for some people this is the end of the trail which is fucking sick but for me this is the beginning the end of the trail for me is gonna be a walk back next to the road so <laughs> that's gonna be fun but sure it's like I don't know it's it's weird oh I'm walking over here I don't know it's weird whenever I walk back on the road after being up here because I just have like so many little like I just have a lot of nicer thoughts once I'm done hiking up here in fact, I just like being up here, honestly, is a good way to clear the head. We got another swing over there. Don't know if you can see it. Right. Let me zoom it. There it is. So, yeah, I like this little part. This little part's sick. Whoa. <laughs> That's sick. All right. I feel like I'm lost in the wild. This is awesome. Why can't there be more places like this? Like imagine you had to walk up here for, to like get to the shop or something. Like that'd be awesome. We need more excuses, or I suppose more reasons to go get lost up in the woods. Well, I mean, I suppose you can just do it for the sake of doing it. But you know, not a lot of people would really be into doing that. So yeah. I don't know, I, I feel like people need to reconnect with nature more because, like, how are you going to miss out on this? <laughs> you get me? Like, how are you going to not go out and enjoy that if it's nearby you? I feel bad for anyone that lives in, like, concrete jungles. Like, I live in a, a pretty big town, I'd say. Like, it's not exactly a small place. But, you know, there's, like... I think I just ate a dragonfly. <laughs> I'm gonna spit that out. There we go. So yeah, you know, I feel bad for anyone that lives in like concrete jungles. Where they just can't find places like this. Because like, man, that is, that is depressing. Ooh, flowers. Nice. <laughs> uh, like, that would just be too much for me. Wouldn't be able to handle it. All right, we're going into an opening here. This marks like quarter of the way. No, it doesn't actually. Never mind, because you guys haven't seen it yet. But once we get up there, I'll show you where the majority of this hike is going to take place. Because right now, again, this is just the beginning. Hold on. That's that right there. Oh, let me put away the gun stick. That right there is the main point. That's like the top point, right? That overlooks the entire place that I live. And it's pretty sick up there, but what I'm excited for is what's over that way. And I'll show it to you once we actually get to a point where you can see, because right now there's just a lot of this. <laughs> There's usually like horses up here too, which is pretty, oh, yep, yeah, there's one. Honestly, this gun's being very inconvenient. Oh, it's, there it is. I think you can see him, he's right there or so. Sirens going off in the background. Always gotta be something to take away from the beauty of this place. Ooh, nice flower. I don't know what that flower's called. Ooh, there's horse shit. <laughs> That's another thing. A lot of this video is gonna be, ooh, there's something. 
Yeah, you at me. Ooh, there's two horses. Yeah, you see. <laughs> you see, exactly. There's three. Holy shit. <laughs> there's four. There, there's just more and more horses. Yo. <laughs> That's hype. That's hype. Hell yeah. <laughs> I want to see if I can get like close enough to them. A beautiful stallion. Cool creatures. I rate them. You're on camera, buddy. <laughs> oh, yeah. Can't see where the uh, fourth one went. It was like, oh, <laughs> it was like more up there. I don't like the noises he's making. That's making me feel a bit scared. I mean, I suppose I'm fine. As long as I don't annoy the horse, it's not gonna kick my, kick my shit. <laughs> Ooh, that's sick. I don't even know if you can see that on camera. It's too bright. Oh, why isn't it focusing? Or is it just blurry? Nah. All right. I think it's just too much. Like I can barely see. So I highly, I think the camera's struggling a lot more than I am to see. But yeah, hold on. Gonna try again. Yeah, you can kinda see. There you go. That looks sick. So yeah, I've been wanting to record this video for like, a good few months now like I wanted to start work on it back in March but back then it was I was planning for it to be like a scripted video where I only record myself at certain parts up here and like then I edit it together and talk about like the main point of like yo you should go out and explore and shit but honestly I think this is a lot better way to do it instead of telling you why you should explore I'm just gonna show you why I'm gonna take you on the journey with me but yeah if you are watching this and you live like nearby a nice place like this like you know a place just oh, there's more litter a place full of like nature and shit I highly recommend you go and do this like just record yourself walking through and just like show it off to the world honestly because like more places like this need to be digitally documented I suppose like damn <laughs> another fly just nearly got in my mouth I feel like that's gonna happen a lot up here Shocked we only ran into three people so far though. Normally a lot more would be walking down this part. Bye bye horses. Nice clear blue sky too. That's awesome. Ooh. So yeah, sort of, if you can peek through there, sort of that little mountainy part is where we're going to be walking for the majority of this walk. Yeah. This place is beautiful. Like the sun setting and everything, so it just feels like peaceful. It just feels good. Nice little dead tree. And these trees look sick. I don't know what they're called. Ooh, I forgot about these parts. Look at these. We have to walk through them. So yeah, I'm wearing a tank top too, so. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna get a few stabs. We might as well just suck it up. <laughs> oh, there we go. Into the clearing. 
The, uh, I know, that, that tree looks pretty sick. Oh, you can see more of the mountain you park too. All right, which way are we walking? That way or that way? I say we go through the path of pain just because we'll earn the view more that way if we suffer for it. <laughs> All right, well, actually, now that I'm looking at it, the way that we're walking is a little behind that. That's like the cover mountain. And we can go up that part, that part too. Probably will, oh, that looks like a sick mountain here. Wanna walk up there one day. There's a lot of mountains I wanna walk up. Cause honestly, there's a lot of cool looking places here. But yeah, for today we're bringing you up this way. Look at that rock. <laughs> Wonder what these actually are. Cause they seem to like be flowering something. And I don't know what it is, but it's a cool plant, I suppose. Just wish it didn't like sting to touch. <laughs> All right, I think over there is like a golf course. Because of course there's got to be a golf course. <laughs> they cut off that little part. Pretty, pretty sucky. There's like a nice little, uh, not river, like a nice little lake slash pond. It's not really too big, but it still looks cool as fuck because it's like surrounded by trees and shit. And unfortunately, you can't go in there unless you're part of the golf club. Which is just like, damn bro, you gatekeep in all the cool places. Really? You at me? Like I hate how in the modern day that just is a thing that people do. Cause this is like, this should be free land. This should just be a place where you can like walk and go. And to be fair, the part that we are walking through is free land. But there's a lot of like extra little beautiful spots that you can't go. That sucks. All right, walking through the gate. Caution, cattle grazing. We aren't anywhere near the cows right now, I don't think. Here, forgot how to open these gates. I always forget. There we go. Pretty loud. All right. Ooh. Got a cool little, uh, little rock. Dad plus Kiana. Pretty sick. I think that's like father daughter. Yeah, but anyway, I like this little rocky part. I don't know why. It's just like a little joy. Over there is a uh, private property. I don't know if you can see that gate. There, I'll zoom in. Yeah, that little gate right there. That's private property. It sucks because it honestly looks like a cool little road. Something got my eye, so yippee. <laughs> I don't know if my phone's gonna have enough storage to record this whole vlog. Well, this whole hike. But uh, I really hope it does because honestly, I'd hate to like have to edit this video. I feel like that spits in the face of what it is. Like this is just meant to be like a nice natural walk. That is blinding, <laughs> but that's so sick. But yeah, if it does get dark up here, I really hope the, uh, the stars are bright. Like I'm hoping the light pollution is just so low that we can see a lot of stars up here. I gotta make sure my phone isn't like dying. All right, well, I can't check, so I guess we're just free balling it. <laughs> I like this little path, I don't know why. Just like a nice little place to walk. probably look like a tourist right now just holding my camera up like yo look at this <laughs> well to be fair this is a place that needs to be shared yo 
it's all comprised of like these little guys so it won't be fun to walk through but it looks sick oh man the other mountains look so cool too this is the mountain that we have decided to walk up I really hope the cows are out. We'll be able to see the cows like halfway through if they are out. Last time I was up here, I saw like a cattle. Well, no, not a cattle, uh, a calf. That was sick. They're really cute animals. Honestly, cows, they were pretty sick. All right, I could go that way, but honestly, I think I'd want to go this way because that way heads up to the cross. And the thing about that is cross means people. So it'd be very awkward to like record while there's like a bunch of people around. <laughs> I hope you guys can understand that by the way. Oh, man, for some reason my stomach's just starting to hurt. Probably nothing. <laughs> I think it's just like a, a stitch from walking too much. I mean, we've only been walking for like 30 minutes, but still. <laughs> oh shit, yeah. We're here already. Damn. All right. Yeah, so this is the part I was talking about. Right, before, right behind that mountain. We're gonna have one hell of a walk. Well, actually, yeah, we'll fucking climb up that, why not? All right. I'm glad there's like a convenient path. Yeah, damn. Just ocean. <laughs> Ooh, that's what I'm talking about. We'll be able to see. Actually, no, we won't because we do walk down that path. The one that kind of like behind that so yeah we'll keep climbing up here look how cool the algae is by the way i don't know why i just really like how it looks oh <laughs> lost my balance for a second there <laughs> but yeah i really like how it looks like all the dead ones too i don't know why like if you look really close it looks like a map I think that's pretty cool. Ooh. All right. It's gonna be pretty windy up here probably. Yep. I can feel it picking up. Little place you can stand and sit down. One time I had a chicken bacon wrap there, it was pretty delicious. <laughs> All right, down we go. I always find it harder to go down than up just because I walk in a very stilted way. <laughs> like, my friends are always laughing at me when I'm walking down mountainsides just because. I'm more safe than sorry, I suppose. But to be fair, I wouldn't want to like trip and fall down here. I feel like that would hurt a lot. <laughs> and especially since both of my hands are occupied, one with the gun and one with the, uh, with the camera. It just like, I just kind of fall and get really hurt. And I don't want to do that. So I'm making sure to walk down safe. Ooh. <laughs> 
making sure to walk down safe falls. There we go. Yeah, walking down real safe there, buddy. <laughs> Jumping on between rocks. Still a sick view up here. But anyway, yeah. So that's gonna be the majority of where we walk. Pretty sure there's people up there, so there will be like that little awkward nothing part. But hey, what's wrong with that? <laughs> Man, this video is going to take so long to upload. All right. We are down. Back on. So, yeah, at this part, we just get to overlook the sea, which I think is pretty cool. England is over that way. Fun fact. Well, not fun fact. No one likes England. <laughs> Sorry to all my English viewers. <laughs> but, yeah, no, like England's over there. I think that's pretty cool. All right, I'm walking down the, uh, the, this way, because there's another way you can walk if you're coming past the cross that just brings us around to that path. But, you know, I am not gonna do that because this is already the path I've chosen. I gotta watch out for the cow poop. That's gonna be an inconvenience to get on my shoes. Wow, it's so quiet up here. Oh, listen to that. You just hear like the gentle waves of the ocean, but the ocean is so far away. So it's like really faint and quiet. It's nice. Excuse me. I ate a bit before I came up here. I was meant to bring water up here too, but I forgot my water bottle at home. So, we're just gonna have to deal with it. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna need it. I mean, I'm gonna want it by the time we're over there, but I don't think we need it for right now. All right, we're nearly on to the meaty part of the walk. This is where we got all the uh, really beautiful spots. Yeah, there's the path. Yeah, just gonna run down. I am gonna end up falling if I do that. But honestly, I don't think I really mind. So yeah. There's the path that leads up to the cross. So yeah, we're gonna be walking down here. And just see when we get I mean we can go over there. We can go over there. Do we? Because that is like a bit of a trek. I know, maybe another day we'll go up there. Get like some B-roll or something for like a random video. Or even just record a video up there. Like honestly, recording a coffee chat wouldn't be too bad an idea up here. Like early morning type shit. Rising grind. And then just like up there with a coffee and a smoke. Oh, some people are setting up camp. I don't want to like record them, but yeah, they're there. <sighs> I know why it's so quiet. Like my mind feels quiet too. I think that's the best part about going on hikes through nature your mind just feels quiet and it's so peaceful a little plane I don't know if you can see it yeah there it is
so nice. I assume anyone that's watching to this point honestly doesn't really care about my commentary. They're just here for the hike. So yeah, I'm probably gonna be a little bit quieter from this point on since I don't think I really need to say anything more. It's just nice up here. More people need to do these type of videos. Just like going on little hikes. It's nice. This is just a beautiful place. I'd love to have like a picnic up here or something. I mean, it still has like all these, all these little buggers, but you know, I'm sure you can find a good place to sit down. What a beautiful way to spend a June day. Up here in the fucking mountains. Just walking. So nice. Damn, they got a full camp set up. Not gonna record them because, ooh, birds. Not gonna record them because respect their privacy. Pew, pew. Ooh. A nice little thorny flower. Lying down, probably asleep. It's probably asleep. <sighs> probably gonna be entertaining myself a lot here too. Just because, like, you know, it's a calm vibe. There's another place I'd really like to go and record on like one of these hiking videos. But honestly, that one's like a five hour trail. So we need to get a phone with a lot beefier storage. Because right now I'm not even sure if this video is gonna be like able to be fully recorded. I think it will be. Like I've cleared up nearly half of my phone storage and about 10 minutes of video, 15 minutes of video, usually only takes around like what 500 to a gigabyte of storage and yeah this I think this is only gonna go on for like two hours so that's like what it's like 12 times that so yeah I'm pretty sure we have enough storage at least I'm hoping I do To be fair, we're closing in on the halfway point. So yeah. I didn't realize just how short of a trail this actually was. Cause in my mind, for some reason I'm like, oh yeah, this walk takes like five hours. But no, it only takes like two hours. And that is like, if you're getting lost too. Getting a bit windier here. Wind's picking up. Oh, I can't wait till we get over there. I really like that spot. It's just thick because there's like a wall. And I really like the wall. Because it's like an old wall. I'm pretty sure it was built probably a long time ago. My pinky's starting to hurt. Cause I'm like holding up the phone with my pinky. But like, yeah, 
My pinky can hurt all at once. I'm recording this video. <laughs> oh, we've come across a murder. <laughs> murder of crows. Pretty sure those are ravens. They're a lot bigger than crows. And for those that didn't know the difference between crows and ravens, there you go. Ooh. Hell yeah. Look at that. That's awesome. Nice little rock there too. And imagine if it snowed in Ireland. Cause like imagine this place just all covered in snow and shit. And like you, you're walking through, you hear like the crunch and the fresh snow. And it's like all white and shit. To be fair, I'm pretty sure it's it does snow up here in winter. Cause it's like high enough of an altitude to actually get snow. So yeah, I, I think honestly. In winter, we might come back up here. Have like a snow day up here. That'd be pretty cool. There's the wall. Wall. Here, I need to do something with the wall. That's a wall. I know why, but just like touching rock, nice. Like that's just a nice feeling on the hand. I'm gonna touch it with the other hand too. Whoa. Yeah, that's just good. Pick up my gun. <laughs> you can see the cross there too. Damn, really nice place. I like the sound. You listen to the crunch. Like, that's just nice. And the sound of the waves too. Like I don't know if you can hear that. I'm hoping you can because honestly, it's a really nice sound. Ooh, there's like sea fog coming in. Didn't realize that. <laughs> Might get foggy up here. Oh no. <laughs> to be fair, I remember coming up here one time when it was foggy. Not this part specifically, but like the part with the cross on it. Honestly, it was pretty nice. I was listening to like black metal and shit. So I was in like the right headspace for it. Just like that really dark and mysterious atmosphere. It was just nice. I really like this part too. If you look down there, you can see a part of a of another trail that brings you around this mountain. And the further we go up here, uh, I'll be able to show you where it actually ends off. Because that starts on the beach that we were able to see back there. And then it goes all around here. Well, it starts next to the part of the mountain that's on the beach. Honestly, that's probably like one of my favorite parts about this place too. The fact that there's a beach right next to it. Like, come on, that's just sick. Yeah, you can see the path more clearly there. You can see like the rocky shore too. I was talking to my friend while he was working before coming out here and I'm gonna send him this video so if you're watching this far 
What's up, Matt? Uh, yeah, so <laughs> I was talking to my friend before I came up here and I told him that I was gonna go on a hike and he asked for pictures. Honestly, I think this is enough pictures. <laughs> I think this is enough pictures for him. Oh, I like these rocks. It's got like the same algae. We can see like all the different shades of like the dead colonies. And it's just like really cool. Cause it does just look like a map. And honestly, I'd love to get lost in a, in a little fantasy world that looks like that. I like this little path so much because by the time I get up here I'm already just so invested in like the nature that honestly I just feel like I'm a part of the path <laughs> and it's so sick like I feel like I'm just a part of this mountain at this point <laughs> and what a way to be Yeah, the sun's getting lower now. You can see it's setting. That means it's gonna start getting dark soon. Oh no! <laughs> I don't even think I'm gonna be able to put on a flashlight, so if it does get dark, I think I might have to end the video, but we'll, we'll make it to the end of the trail before that happens. We'll make it. But honestly, I think I might just sit up here a little bit later on when the sun is set because I want to like stargaze up here I think those campers had the right idea honestly I've never gone camping but if I were to go camping anywhere it's definitely up here oh cow there was a bug in my mouth but that's worth it because it's a bovine Hell yeah. Is he okay? I don't know if he's stuck or not, but honestly, I'm too scared to go out and try and help him. Well, her, I don't see any horns. So, wouldn't be, wouldn't be uh, him. I don't think, is that how it works? I don't even know. If it was a bull, I think, I'd be dead by now. <laughs> so I think it is a missus. Little bird making noises. Woo! No bird. <laughs> Pretty sure that was a swift. But I don't know my bird, so I won't really be able to tell you. It's getting a little bit more windy up here too. So I, I don't know if the microphone is gonna be able to pick up my voice clearly enough. But sure, it doesn't really matter. You can still see everything. Yeah, I'll be able to show you is up here. So yeah, that little path that we saw coming out down there, we can see more of it down there or so. Yeah, like you can, you can kind of see it. Basically that leads all the way around there, all the way around there and to that little place, that town. 
it's a really nice walk. Don't get me wrong, but honestly, I prefer this one. But yet again, it's been so long since I've gone on that walk. Apparently, like, all the rocks keep eroding. So it's, like, not possible to walk there or, like, it's dangerous or something. I don't really know. Kind of a shame because it is a nice place. Like, it is a nice little trail you can go on. But honestly, as long as we still have, like, this part, you get me. Because, like, damn. That's for the beta walkers, anyway. Because it's just all, like, smoothed out and shit. Like, you can walk down there completely fine. There's no sense of adventure. You get me? I mean, you know, I'm talking a lot of shit about it, but honestly, I really like that other trail. It's so nice. I think I just like any little hike. Like just going out and just chilling out for like an hour. It's honestly just really nice. I keep trying to capture as like much of the landscape as possible because it's just so nice. Like that blinded me, but damn, it was worth it to just barely be able to see everything. Here, well, let's see if I can show you that a bit more clearly. Whoa. Yeah, that, that works. You can kind of see what I'm trying to show you. Honestly, I don't think any camera is really going to be able to capture the full beauty of places like this. Just because you just need to see this shit through your own eyes. You get me? Nice little crunchy, crunchy path. I wonder if we're going to run into any calves while we're up here. Because usually... Well, the last place, well, last time I was up here, I saw one, like, kind of down, down that way. So, yeah, I wonder if we're going to see any more. Or if it's just going to be that one cow that we saw back there. I'd love to try and pet one of them, but honestly, I think that might be a very risky move. Like, I don't really want to have to deal with cow trying to hurt me. Because in, in that fight, I lose 100%. <laughs> Cow a lot stronger than me. Damn, that's good. Wow. Honestly, I don't even know what to say to that. That's just beautiful. And like the smell of cow shit too, honestly just adds. Like it really feels like you're just out in the wild. Feels like I'm on a farm. Well, technically I am on a farm, but like it's just so nice. Like that farm scent and this view, awesome. Oh, I think there's a cow over there. Go say hi. Honestly, I want to go on like a little run, but I think that might scare the cows. I don't really want to do that because this is where they live. I'm merely a visitor in this land. I am merely a, a visitor to this guy's house. <laughs> oh, there's two cows. Hell yeah. Oh, there, there's a bunch of them. Let's go. That one's swirling its tail around. Oh, we're gonna be walking real close by one. Hope I don't scare it. 
because if I do scare it, that's me dead. And this video doesn't go up. <laughs> I like that little cloud, I don't know why. Here, let me see if I can get that nice little cloud. I know, like that, there's clouds over there too, like around the sun, but I know, like that little just stray cloud is pretty cool looking. down dinner time boys yeah I really hope none of these are dudes otherwise I am just actually dead <laughs> oh they're moving that one's looking at me you see him there he is Hey buddy, don't worry, I'm not pointing my gun at you. <laughs> There's one on the trail. We're so close though. It's been so long since I've been this close to a cow. Hey buddy. <laughs> this is awesome. <laughs> I think this is the best part of the video. Uh -huh. I like that one. It's really cute. That one too. Man, that one that walked like straight in front of us, like, <laughs> there was like a little bit of fear, honestly. <laughs> like, I didn't know if that guy wanted to hurt me. But nah, she was just chilling. Just walking across the path. <laughs> and see, this is why you go outside, because sometimes shit like that happens. That's yeah, pretty cool. You can't experience this shit from inside your home. Well, I guess now you have, but there, it's like a different feeling in real life. Seeing the creatures that we inhabit the earth with, it's honestly pretty nice. Cause I feel like a lot of us just only see people most of the time. Or like a pet too, and maybe birds. But like seeing like like big animals like that, and like the horses too, really makes you think just how fucking lucky we are to call this Earth our home. We're about to get out of the uh, the cattle grazing section of the mountain, and it's. It's only been an hour, too. Like, I don't know, I'm just shocked at how quick that was. Like, we went through a lot of places there. Ah, oh, the sun setting on the rocks. Oh, like, look at, golden hour. <laughs> it's golden hour, boys. Gotta open one of these gates too. I really don't want to scare the cows because I think they might hurt me. Here. There we go. I'm gonna close that more gently just so the cows don't get started. All right. There we go. That was a bit louder than I wanted, but. You know, is how it is. Oh, my hair's just all up in my face now. I had to tie it up into a bun, but 
it's become more and more loose as we've walked just because of like the movement and shit so now I just have like a bunch of strands all up in my face but yeah we're coming to we're coming to the end <laughs> that's so weird like I thought it would be a lot longer but honestly that was a pretty short walk well I mean it's been an hour but <laughs> you know still so fucking glad I got to come up here it's just very beautiful this time of year nice old June hike yeah hold on I was talking earlier about like how on the golf course there's like a little river or like a little pond or something there it is can't really get into it unfortunately but yeah if I do end up uh, going to the other place I was talking about there's like a huge lake there I'm pretty sure there is anyway yeah there is yeah so I'd love to like show you around there but I'd, I wouldn't be able to record the full hike maybe I'd be able to record like the little forested part but I wouldn't be able to record the full hike Honestly, I gotta start planning my trip up there. Because, you know, it, it's a very far away from where I live. So I'd need to like, plan, like there's a, there's a cab that brings you there that you can just like public transport type shit, right? Ooh, I like that flower. Hmm. I know, it just, it feels so quiet. It's nice. But yeah, uh, there's public transport that brings you up there. So I want to like start planning that trip out. Because I told myself this summer I am definitely going up there. I asked friends to go up there too. I don't know if they're going to be joining me. But either way, I am going up there. And honestly, I wouldn't mind like doing that hike solo because honestly it'd be pretty nice One thing I really like about, oh, that's the wrong way. One thing I really like about doing this hike in particular is that by the time you get to this point, there's usually always just one random person or like two random people walking their dog and they always say hi. It's just so nice. Like that interhuman contact just right at the end of the hike. Oh, I just love it up here. This is nice. Usually I forget to say hi just because I'm honestly too focused on walking. And I always like regret it because I'm like, oh no, I didn't say hi back. But yeah, that time I caught it. His dog was cute too. But yeah, that's why I had the camera facing down that way just because someone was walking by. So yeah, we're coming near the end now. And honestly, it's been a, it's been a nice walk. So yeah, we're getting back into civilization now, you can tell from the radio tower.
turn of the crunchy path. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm pretty glad with that. We picked up uh, four pieces of litter. Uh, I, I found this gun stick. And uh, yeah, we walked for a bit. We saw the cows up close and personal. And yeah, there's uh, the end right there. Very ominous looking. <laughs> Just how that looks right there. Like, that looks so ominous. Walk into the trees. That's the end of the hike. <laughs> yeah, no. I have a 15 minute walk to look forward to to get back home. So yeah, I'm gonna have fun with that. Just gonna be alone with the thoughts and shit. Ooh, just hit my keys in my pocket with the gun. <laughs> so yeah, let's just reflect back for a second. Yeah, I think this is where, go where I'm gonna end it. I would flip the camera around, but there's no uh, option for that. Yeah, it's been a nice walk, hasn't it? So yeah, I'm gonna get home now. <laughs> uh, so yeah, have a good rest of your day. Or rest of your night. Depending on what time you're watching this. And remember to keep running when no one else is. See you tomorrow.